Science is a continuous exploration of better and better ways of thinking the world, abandoning old notions and finding new ones uh, that work better, and it's a passionate exploration, because everybody who is immersed in science doesn't do that for a salary. It's like paintings or writing music. You do that because you love it and you can't do, do anything else. And this path is always based on questioning the current uh, knowledge. Every step, you abandon something of before, which means that you're never sure, because at every step, you think that in the future, you, you're going to realize that something you know today might turn out to be wrong. Uh, so, the basic of science is not uh, thinking that we know, but realizing that we do not know. The more one is aware of our own uh, lack of knowledge, the more science can progress. The difficult part is always not so much to get new ideas. New, new ideas are cheap. It's to realize which one of our current ideas are wrong. It's abandoning ideas, which is, uh, uh, which is uh, hard. And because of that, science is always rebellious, because it questions continuously uh, ideas. It's critical and, uh, and uh, rebellious. And you can say, well, wait a minute. You, you're Making a picture of science like uh, it's, a, it's a total mess, we're never sure of anything. Yes and no, because of course we're never sure of anything, but by its very nature of questioning continuously, um, science provides us at each moment the most reliable picture that we have. That's why scientific um, thinking is, works. Not because it's certain, but because it's reliable. It's more reliable than anything else. It's the best we have so far. And why is the best we have so far? Because it does not pretend to be final, so it keeps correcting itself.